Good morning, folks. It's Diamond with the Oppenheimer Ranch Project Magnetic Reversal News and Shinrin Yoku, bringing you a Grand Solar Minimum update Wednesday, February 24th, around noon time, 2021. The uptick has begun in Iceland. Multiple moderate earthquakes, the largest 5.6, downgraded from 5.7, has occurred on the Reykjanes Ridge. This is an event we've been waiting for. It happened as a small CME hit Earth earlier today. The earthquakes began slightly after 6 p.m. UTC. The largest quake at 10 p.m. UTC corresponds here to when the phi angle passes 180 and the BZ has the largest shift. Now, this is associated with a very large earthquake swarm, thousands of quakes. Uh, so let's read about it. The largest earthquake in the swarm had a magnitude of M5.7, was felt over most of western Iceland. Minor damage has been reported in Reykjavik, but it's limited to stuff falling off shelves, walls, and other such locations. Here you can see the array of earthquake activity along that ridge. And this is all associated with the Reykjanes volcanic system, which is on the southwestern tip of Iceland on the mid-ocean ridge. And the most recent activity of this magnitude happened back in the 20th of October. And this was when we knew, and if you go check our update from back then, that this was beginning to accelerate. Uh, there was a 5.6 earthquake on the 20th of October, 2020, five kilometers west of the geothermal area in Selton, the largest earthquake since 2003. There were 1,700 aftershocks recorded in the following 24-hour period. Very similar event going now, slightly larger. And there was reports of rock falls in steep areas, in, including gas odors in the vicinity. Four landslides were noted near the epicenter. And this event is no different. There has been an update. There has been an increase in activity, much larger earthquakes happening over the last 12 hours. And according to pictures from Iceland Coast Guard, steam has been seen from the area that had the strongest earthquake this morning. It seems to be an area that did not have steam <laughs> earlier, any steam activity. But this needs confirmation. So here you can see the uptick in seismic activity here. We're going to blow it up here at the end of the video. And there was some information I saw about magma but I can't seem to find it for you this morning. But there is a large earth uh, uptick in the Reykjanes volcano. And what does that mean for us? Well, we'll check the eruptive history here. The last major eruption was back during uh, the Dalton Minimum in 1830, confirmed at VEI-3. 1783, another confirmed VEI-3. And back in the Maunder Minimum, some more eruptions. So Reykjanes Ridge is on target as our first major cyclical eruption to begin during this grand minima magnetic reversal phase of our life on Earth. And thankfully, it only has a history of erupting at VEI-3. So while there will be major disruptions, because these are not small events, they're long duration type eruptions, could be a week, 10 days or more, we are seeing the first signs of that uptick and the Reykjanes Ridge which has an eruptive history as high as VEI-4. Here we can see the 1226 eruption. So anything is possible coming from Reykjanes vol Volcano moving forward. We're just bringing you up to speed on the current information. Here you can see that uptick in just the last six hours. During the day today, up, up, and away. There's the 5.7 and a, just thousands of moderate quakes Majority of which coming above here, two magnitudes. So quite a significant event at the Reykjanes volcano. And this event is ongoing. So we're going to keep a close eye on it for you tonight. Check the update later tonight for more updates because that will give us another 12 hours or so of data. Proper prior planning prevents piss poor performance when Reykjanes volcano in Iceland is about to blow. Be safe. We love you. That's a boom to knowledge. Click on one of the other boxes to gain more of it.